All right, so next up we have the first of our two new categories for the 15th annual No DQ Year End Awards. Most overutilized of the year. The nominees, the Bella Twins, Kane, Mark Henry, John Cena, Big Show, and Randy Orton. This is a hard one because, yeah. you know, Big Show was way overutilized so much that they uh, they can't decide if they want to turn him heel or face. Yeah, that's all they know what that's to, all do, to with do with him. him yeah. Uh, the Bella Twins, they saw way too much fucking TV time exactly. this year. Way too much. Uh, Kane, again, they can't decide they want to have him be Demon Kane or Corporate, Corporate Kane, Kane or Concessions Kane or, you know, Semi-Retired Kane or Undertaker's Little Brother Kane or what the fuck they want to do with him. Mark Henry, again, the same thing Big Show, heel turn, babyface turn. They don't know what they want to do with him. But my two picks are the two guys that have been world champion for most of this year. John Cena, Randy Orton. People are sick of both of them. So much so they're 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 clamoring for Cena to turn heel and they're clamoring for Orton to turn babyface. Again, just to have something different yeah. from either of them. I'm so, I'm surprised that you would pick Cena because you've always been a big John Cena supporter. I am I will forever be a John Cena supporter for many reasons. I'm not gonna tell you all because any damn business. But they use him way too much. He's on every Monday Night Raw. He, he if, if they put him on SmackDown, it'd be even worse. Right. In fact, if they don't put him on SmackDown, that's a good thing. Yeah. But I, I'm not going to go with John Cena because he's still making the company money. If he wasn't making the company money, then I would make more of an argument for him being most okay. overutilized. I'm going to go with the Bella Twins because I think they're in the spot, the spot that they're in because of who they're married to. And dating in real life. I mean, I think that that's the bottom line with that. And, uh, you know, I don't think that they've earned the position that they're in in the company. That's just my personal opinion. I don't think they have the in-ring talent and uh, certainly don't have the acting skills. I mean, they have shown a little bit of improving, improvement in the ring. In the ring, yeah. Especially but, Nikki. Nikki was leaps and bounds better than she was a year ago. Yeah, I just... That, that, that whole storyline with the SummerSlam match and all that, I just think they got too much TV time and the storyline really fell flat. So I'm going to go with the Bella Twins. 